Let's begin by binning up the different types of automated vehicles that are out there on the road driving around today or are planned to be on the road soon. The first is low speed shuttles. Low speed shuttles typically carry up to 15 passengers. They run a fixed route like a bus uh, at perhaps five or 10 miles per hour. O often they can go up to 25, but they usually operate more slowly than that. And there have been demonstrations in cities around the world. The safety approach for these shuttles is generally based on an argument that they go very slow, therefore they have limited kinetic energy and they can only do limited damage. There's often a non-driver safety conductor. So there's a person assigned to be in the shuttle and help load and unload passengers and ensure safety, but many times they do not have access to controls while the shuttle is operating. There have been a number of mishaps with these shuttles. Uh, one that got a lot of press was a shuttle hit by a backing truck. This shuttle was designed to stop when something got too near, so its way of being safe is to come to a stop when it might have an issue. Uh, but in this case, it stopped right behind the truck. The truck driver assumed the shuttle was going to move out of the way and hit the shuttle at low speed. The conductor inside the shuttle did not have access to controls and tried to make noise and otherwise draw the attention of the truck driver, but that failed, and the truck driver realized something was wrong when he made contact with the shuttle. Fortunately, no one was hurt in that incident. There have been a number of false alarm stops throwing people around the interior. Uh, more recently, the pictures of these shuttles show seat belts, and hopefully the conductor is having people buckle up 